Let's open my scoopers and poopers list on Twitter. 15 members. Access media shells. Rotten critics. Let's see what they're talking about. Oh shit, what the f- <laughs> Social media embargo for Wonder Women 1984 has been lifted. Germaine Lucier. Yesterday I saw Wonder Woman 1984 at home and it was everything I needed and more. The movie is hugely ambitious incredibly exciting and full of much needed hope. It's also very long to a fault at times, but mostly it reminded me of how wonderful a big blockbuster can make you feel. Megan Damore says, Honoured to have been among the first press to see Wonder Woman 84. I enjoyed the first film, but I loved Wonder Woman 84 even more. Although I wish we'd gotten the change to see it earlier, the movie came out at possibly the perfect time for its hope optimism and message. Eric Davis. I'm so happy to report that Wonder Woman 84 is an absolute blast from start to finish. An exceptional compliment to the first film. It's stuffed with heart. Love, action, romance and humour. Jenkins, Gadot and team delivered one of DC's best sequels. I was in tears when it ended. Here he is. Zooming it up with Patty and Gal yesterday. Jim Veg Voda. I saw Wonder Woman 1984 yesterday. It was a lot of fun and has a very heartwarming and hopeful message that frankly we really need this year. Looks like Wonder Woman 1984 is all about that accelerated hope and optimism. Dorian Parks. I had the chance to watch Wonder Woman 1984 early. I loved the first film and I can confidently say the sequel takes everything to another level. Pedro Pascal and Kristen Wiig absolutely kill it as Maxwell Lord and Cheetah. Let Patty Jenkins take charge of the entire DCEU? What you just said is one of the most insanely idiotic things I have ever heard. Of course Stephen Weintraub got to see it early. It's always the same faces, same names. His buddy Brandon Davis. Pedro Pascal and Kristen Wiig are the highlights of 184 for me. Pascal goes all in on a wild portrayal of Max Lord a conflicted but vile villain. Rex Cheetah evolution throughout the movie is heartbreaking yet epic. We need more. So let me know guys. Do you trust these reactions for Wonder Woman 94? Huh? From the usual suspects are now praising the Jeff Johns written Wonder Woman 1984. So click like cause you know I'm right. Let me know in the comments below. If you care then you can share. You smash that mother fucking subscribe button and also enable all notifications so you know when I upload a new video. But until next time, in knuckleheads, I'm Shorty and you're not. Ta ta. Mwah.